Play is a core way for children to learn that promotes the physical, cognitive and social-emotional outcomes essential for school readiness and academic success. Yet bringing playful learning into schools is complicated, which is why the Pedagogy of Play project was initiated in 2015 to investigate the paradox between the nature of play and the nature of school and to support educators in navigating these paradoxes and leveraging the power of playful learning. Play is timeless. You lose yourself in play, whereas um, school has timetables. Play can be less messy, chaotic, loud. Schools aspire to be a place of order. To help teachers um, be able to create both of those things is that they need a pedagogy, a systematic approach to teaching and learning that will help them navigate the paradoxes between learning and play. The Pedagogy of Play project was initially launched in 2015 at the International School of Billund in Denmark. But as play is determined by cultural contexts, in 2017 the project grew to include three primary schools around Johannesburg to investigate what playful learning would look and feel like in a South African school. One of the schools is the Nova Pioneer School, who already had valuable experiences with using play and joy in the classroom. You learn best when you are happy. It's the idea of being, not being afraid of risk, being, not being afraid of failure, and because so, that's what play is about. And our students are not afraid of failure. It's very important for us that we uh, foster a, a skill set where there's lots of collaboration in the classroom. Uh, and we value what it is that they say, and so their voice is important to us. Uh, because they feel valued in their learning, and because they feel value in their learning, they want to be here. What it does is it gives the teachers the opportunity to be themselves. Uh, it gives the teachers the opportunity to allow students to be a part of the learning. The way in which we manage the paradox of play with traditional schooling is that we actually have all of our teachers on the same page. Uh, it doesn't necessarily solve for the problem uh, of, of having maths at a particular time and having science at a particular time. But if you've got a cultural principle that overrides the subjects, joy of learning being one of them, um, it does help and support that philosophy. The style of teaching that I used in my old school was very traditional and coming to Nova Pioneer it's a completely new method that we're using. Um, giving the students so much in the class where it's like 80 to 90 percent of student voice and the teacher taking that little and having to step back. I found my first few months a, a major struggle um, but now that I'm teaching this way I don't think I can ever go back to teaching the way I used to.